So last week about this time, Nanny and I were basking in the sun at the fire pit. <laughs> uh, not this week though. What a difference a week makes. But in the meantime, uh, I have an unboxing video we're going to do today. So, uh, by the way, welcome back to Grampy's Workshop. I'm so glad you dropped by. <laughs> Not a normal opening, but anyways, I thought I'd do this just for a change. I have an unboxing, so let's go out in the shop and have a look at what it's all about. Alright, so we're going to unbox these lights. Now, these are a no-name light. I just found them on, on Amazon. They were cheap. But let's open them up and see what's inside. Two lights. See what we get. Oops. Well, there's one of them, and, they, oop, and there's the second one. And there, there's there's no information or directions. It's just a picture on the box. It says there's a switch button on the side. It says there's a hook on the end. It says there's a USB charging port, and it says. Uh, there's a front end wick, whatever that means. I think it means it's a front end light on it. Uh, it says it's got a magnet on it too. Alright, anyways, let's just see what we can see here. When I took them out, there was two USB cables popped out, so they do charge USB wise. So, my first look at the light here, uh, I was concerned that it was going to be too small. Uh, because ones I've seen on YouTube were, were a little bit bigger than this, but uh, the the light bar folds out, and like that's a nice size for holding on to, and it's balanced. Light. It's not it's not too heavy. I mean, there's a battery in here, but it's not too heavy. And there's the switch, and down here at the bottom is the USB port where you just plug it into any kind of USB outlet, and it'll recharge. And like I said, there's no instructions with it, so I don't know whether you have to recharge it for a month or a week or a day or 20 minutes or I don't know. But anyways, it will recharge. I guess that's a good thing. So it has the hook where you can just hang it up. And that just clips on the end. It's like a bale. Put that cover in the charge port there. And it has a magnetic base. Uh... I don't know. The base could be a little stronger, maybe. The magnet, I mean, but anyway, it, it works all right. As long as you're not hammering and banging at it, should be okay. Let's see if it works. I haven't charged yet, I just took it out of the box. Oh, yeah. Look at that, pretty bright. Nice light. So that's one click. Two clicks gives you a dimmer light. Three clicks gives you, uh, I guess that's what they're, they're talking about. When they say a front end wick, <laughs> there's a front end wick on the torch. <laughs> okay, and then so that's three clicks, four clicks, everything shuts off. So there you go. It's just called Work Light. There's no brand name on it, and uh, I'm certainly not sponsored by these people. It's just one that I found on YouTube on uh, Amazon, and it was cheap. Um, like I was saying, I was concerned that it, maybe it's a little bit too small. But you know what? When you're working on stuff, uh, it seems to me that it's tight spaces where you can't see what's going on. So you want to get down in those tight spaces to see. So this light should fit in those tight spaces pretty decent. And it is like bright. I like it. So I think I was first off, first off I was concerned about the size. I thought it was too small. But I think it's going to be nice. Uh, I'm going to put one of those right away. I'm going to take it out and put it in the glove compartment of the car. Because it's always nice to have a good flashlight in the car. And one that you can recharge. And there's a USB port in the car. So I can just chuck that in and charge it up whenever I want. So, not bad. So I think these lights are going to be pretty neat. Uh, I'm a little bit uh, OCD in me, I think. So I'm going to take my label maker and I'm just going to make a couple labels. Call this one light one, light two. Just because, you know, that's me. By the way, these little label makers, 
this is some handy, you know, and I'll put a link down below. And I'm always making labels for this or that or the other thing. And if you're anything like me, the only one who can read my writing is, is Nanny. <laughs> so it's nice to have the, uh, the label maker. So then I just take my snips and trim it down to size. I don't know how, how well these labels will stick here, but I'm going to stick it right up here at the top. I say I'm not sure how well it'll stick because the surface of this is kind of like a soft, uh, well it's not really soft, but it's got a satin finish on it. So it's not, doesn't stick real good. You know what? No, oh, that might work out alright. I was going to say I could put it right on this bar here because that's nice, smooth. Anyhow, that's where I'm going to put it, right on there. Alright, there. Light one, light two. Two nice lamps. I recommend them. So far, I like them. Not a bad light, boys, I'm telling you. Pretty nice. Uh, it's a nice lightweight light. It's got a nice grip on it. And I was thinking maybe it was going to be too small, but it's nice and bright, and I think the small size is going to be a benefit because it'll be able to get in places maybe where a bigger light wouldn't. So, if you're thinking about getting yourself a work light or a shop light or a task light, maybe this is something you could consider. Now, I'm not sponsored by these folks, so that's not why I'm promoting it. I just think that it's going to be a nice little light. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm so glad you dropped by. Boys, it's great to have you. And for my regular viewers, thanks again for all your support. And uh, you saw there the video I took of the fire pit, like buried in snow. This time last week, we had no snow. That's when I made that video about Nanny and I sitting at the fire. It was plus 13 degrees. Well, it's been minus 13 most of the week since then. And now tomorrow they're calling for about, I don't know, three or four inches of snow. And then it's supposed to turn to about three or four inches of freezing rain. So, you know, if the weather changes all the time. So if it's nice out, get out and enjoy it. And uh, maybe take a task light with you. <laughs> thanks for watching. Appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, thanks for dropping by. I appreciate it. I hope you come back often. And if you're a regular viewer, thanks a lot for dropping by. I appreciate it. I hope you come back often. Don't forget, thumbs up me. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Have a great week. We'll talk to you soon.